little earlier, we showed you some of the high-tech wonders to be found in the new San Francisco Public Library. But the opening also features a distinctly low-tech controversy. It's about a hundred-year-old statue that has been moved to the library. And as Chronicles Phil Mateer tells us, the storm is all about political correctness. Welcome to San Francisco's latest political controversy, a 100-year-old statue called the Pioneer Memorial. Now, for years, this old piece of iron stood around collecting dust and pigeons. But now that it's the centerpiece of the new jewel of a library, well, it's entered the area of politics, or in this case, political correctness. For starters, Native Americans are objecting to the portrayal of the Indian in the statue. They say that he's surrendered, he's given up. The victorious vaquero and the condescending priest, they say that's not the image they want at all. Well, the San Francisco Arts Commission agreed, and they also agreed to put a plaque here. It would basically explain the historical value of this piece of work, and also question whether the Padres wound up killing half the Indians while they were trying to convert them. Stanley Gotti, you're the president of the Arts Commission. You're putting the plaque here. Isn't this taking political correctness a bit too far? Yes. Well, as you can imagine, the Catholics, wait a minute, yes? Then why are we doing it? Well, we need to. We're, we're trying to make um, organizations happy. That's what political correctness is all about. Why here? Why now? It was requested. So what, are we just, whenever anybody requests something, we do it? No, but when the majority of people make enough of a noise and make enough of a sound to do it, we do. We have to, we have to try to do whatever we can. But in the process, we're making nobody happy. That's what political correctness is all about. <laughs> and there you have it, folks. A lesson in the art of politics, San Francisco style. Phil Mateer, News Center 4. <laughs> That's it.